here they come to save the day. Ah, oh, those boys are so good at what they do. But it is cookie day here in our espresso kitchen, and we all love baking cookies, and I'm sure we love to eat them just as much. But how much do we know about our favorite tea time treats? Well, we've called in the expert. Kate George is going to tell us more about what makes them so popular and exactly what different names they have and how to make them. Kate, so good to have you on Espresso. Thanks, Leanne. So I see a whole range of different yeah. cookies here. Tell me more about what you've got displayed here. Okay, well, these are basically a run of what you'll see in most supermarkets, what you'll try at home, yeah. kind of all the cookies we eat. Awesome. And each each one of them's got a different method to, ma to making them. Okay. Um, so we've got to start off with a crunchy, which is called a bar cookie. This one's so, called a bar cookie. Yeah, yummy. so you basically make your mixture, mm -hmm. it gets pushed into a tray, cooked, often quite often layers, so millionaire shortbread is a bar cookie, and then you cut it into its shape and serve it usually in a bar shape. Yummy. Um, then we've got a drop cookie, which is a um, like something like a chocolate chip biscuit. Is it because you drop it into your cup of coffee while you're, while you're eating it? <laughs> when half of it drops, when it gets a bit wet, soggy. Yeah. Um, no, basically it's a very soft dough. You just take a spoon, drop it onto a tray and bake mm. it. Um, then we've got the peanut butter cookies we're doing later. Okay. Those are molded, so you mold them into a ball. They get a shape on a tray and then get baked. Okay, molded cookies. And then we've got something called a pressed cookie, which is like a strip waffle or a wafer that's actually pressed into a shape when it cooks. So it gets a nice marking on it. Mm -hmm. um, refrigerated cookies are like shortbread, so okay. it's a batter that has to be, or a dough that has to be refrigerated before nice. it gets baked. Um, and then we've got just a rolled um, cookie, which is what you make a gingerbread man or yeah, 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 yeah. Christmas decorations out of. It's a, it's a dough that can be rolled out mm -hmm. and then cut out. And then finally, we've got a sandwich cookie. So um, that's something that's going to have a nice soft center. Oh, nice. Like a lemon which meringue you sandwich cream. together. Yes, Fantastic. Absolutely. So that's the array of biscuits that you see and cookies that you see most in most of the shops. Wow, who would have thought that so much goes into actually making cookies and that they all have these different names as well. Mm. But after the break, we are going to be making these delicious peanut butter cookies with chalk drizzle. So uh, I hope that we've enlightened you as to all of the names our favorite tea time treats have. Now we got, we're about to go to a break. When we come back, uh, we'll be making these yummy, yummy cookies. I'm gonna have one of these, one of these. <laughs> Can I have one, one of, of everything? These, so one of these, we'll like. see you right back after this. And one of these.